What up, what up, Sports Money Crew? Here we go, checking in late night with you guys. Promised you some looks on the Wimbledon tournament tomorrow. It's a big major. Why not get some early money action before we get to the Euros, before we get to MLB, and then finish it off with Copa. And I got three games I think we can get paid on here. I'm going to try to keep it short, sweet, and to the point. I need you guys to show the support. Hit the thumbs up button if you want more of this kind of late night drop and had the chance to look at this thing here. 7.30 a.m. Eastern. I'm starting off with a nice juicy dog, but we're not going to go right on the money line here. We're going to go to Arter Katzow plus 205 versus Alexander Bublik at minus 260. Again, early morning matchup here. And I got to go to the young up and comer. He's a Frenchman out there in his most recent major with the Australian Open running and gunning. He went in advance beyond his expectations, getting himself to elevate his game in these grand slams. He's a grass player. He likes to go get the job done. And I think here's an opportunity where we saw recent opponents, Tomas Echeverry, a guy that we just cashed on easily with the minus two and a half. But we've also taken our opportunities with Vertanen fading Echeverry out there two tournaments back. And Katzal was able to get the job done. I'm going to go a little different here, though. I want the plus four and a half games. I want the minus 115. I think that's fair money. Be competitive. Play the grass game that he can. And uh, maybe he's even a live dog. Second game we're going to look at here is 10 a.m. And we are dogging in this one. We're taking a peek at Lloyd Harris. Here's a guy formally ranked inside that top 100. Falling out, whether it be injuries, poor performance, what have you. He's 30 and 13 this season. He's competitive, and we see he's playing Ben Shelton. If it wasn't for the lighting delay, Ben Shelton was getting eliminated last round here. I think it's a great opportunity out here. We've got Lloyd, a named guy, and we look at Shelton, who almost got beaten by Flavio Como in the first round. Again, that lightning delay, the lighting delay was the advantage for Ben Shelton. The dog in Lloyd Harris, plus 122, former top 100 player, gets the job done. Last but not least, we're going to go to the women's side of Wimbledon. We've got Vervara Gracheva at plus 125. Early steam alert on this girl, moved her from plus 110 all the way to even money. This match got delayed because, again, of lighting at Wimbledon. I don't know when they're going to put lights on the court. They haven't done it yet. And we've got, you know, Yastra Zemska. She's struggling. She's not showing control. She's not in great form. And she's rolling 19 and 13 on the season. Now, granted, we did look at Gracheva beating Serenko 6 3 6 1 in the first round as a dog. Moving forward again, 16 and 8 this year on the clay. Grass is going to be a little bit different for this girl, but I think she can go out there and handle it despite the early steam coming in from the Sharps. We have things now moving to a tremendous value at plus 125. Vervara, Gretcheva, plus 125 is going to be the way we get paid the early three spot in Wimbledon tomorrow morning. Make sure you guys hit the like button. We'll stay tuned for more tips. Appreciate it.